One industry that has seen an uptick in interest during this pandemic is a company that teaches how to perform CPR. The DISC Foundation mission is to train and certify free of charge anyone who wants to learn CPR. And joining me this morning to talk more about this is Mackenzie Thompson with the DISC Foundation. Good morning to you, Mackenzie. Good morning. How are you? Very good. So good to see you this morning, and thanks for joining us. I understand your organization usually sees 20,000 visitors a day, but that those numbers have actually shot up to 120,000 since this pandemic started. Tell us why. Yes, so we are seeing a huge influx in people wanting to learn online. Um, The mission of our company is to empower people to save lives, and during this crazy time of the pandemic, Um, A lot of people are feeling insecure and not empowered of the situation, but what we're able to do is train them and certify them online um, with our training courses in CPR, AED, and first aid so that they can feel empowered of the current situation and also use this skill later on in life if a medical emergency does occur. You guys must be thrilled that you've had this uptick because this is your mission to train as many people as possible. And I understand that even though you're based in Chicago, you're actually working remotely uh, from New York City. What has that been like there? Um, The the city's gone silent. It's a really a surreal feeling um, to go from the total hustle and bustle that everybody knows New York of being to just silence in the streets, but I'm, I'm very proud of my community um, and the seriousness that we've taken with the stay-at-home orders and the 7 p.m. clap every day um, where everybody opens their windows and claps with their pots and pans um, to honor the healthcare workers who are risking their lives to save our lives. And through the DISC Foundation, it's really been an honor of ours to be able to help the healthcare providers who need certified and are not able to get that in person anymore. So we've been able to meet them online, get them trained and certified for free so that they can go to work in the hospitals and continue to save lives. That is fantastic. And, you know, we join you in that celebration. You guys do it uh, at 8 o'clock, excuse me, at 7 o'clock, and we do it at 8 o'clock every night. And it just makes you feel so good to see all that support out there. But you guys aren't just working with healthcare workers. Uh, you're all, people are also coming to you, the average citizen. Tell us about that. Correct. Anybody can get trained and certified in CPR. It's it's for more than just healthcare providers. It's for laypersons, people like you and me, who just want to have the knowledge in case an emergency does happen. So a large number of people coming to our sites right now aren't even healthcare professionals. They're moms, dads, children who are looking for some new information um, with all of this extra time on their hands so that they can come out of this with a new skill and feeling empowered to save a life. That is fantastic. And I love that you guys are offering this for free. If our viewers would like more information, we are told to go to discfoundation.org. Thanks so much for joining us this morning. Thank you. Great to see you. We'll be right back. The NICOR Gas Energy Efficiency Program presents